Hi, my name's Jay and I'm going to be filming myself for the next week on our first ever family ski holiday. We are flying tomorrow out to Meribel and I hear the snow conditions are meant to be fantastic. I have to say I'm quite nervous about this. Um, I'm not the fittest person in the world. I have been doing lots of of ski exercises um, in the last couple of weeks. I probably should have been doing it longer than that, but you know, you've got to do what you've got to do. I'm really, really excited about um, about the whole family learning to ski at the same time. Um, lots of my friends go on ski holidays with their families and I've always felt like I was missing out. Um, but I wondered if I was a bit too old to learn. I was a bit worried about driving in the snow. So I've booked transfers through the ski chalet company, Ski Basics. Um, so we'll be met at the airport for hopefully quite a stress-free experience. And then we hit the slopes on Sunday for our first ever ski lesson. So we've just come back from our first day of skiing and I have to say I absolutely loved it. Um, it was perfect conditions, the, the, um, the sky was clear but um, it wasn't too bright and sunny, um, it, the, the snow was so powdery and fresh um and and you know we we just had so much fun um, zoe was our teacher today from new generation ski school we went up to Monterey from Maribel because there's a magic carpet up there, which is really good to um, uh, to learn on. It's a, a like a track that goes up the nursery slope, so it's it's really easy to get up and uh, up to the top of the slope. Um, and in no time, I I had found my ski legs. Um, I didn't fall over once, which I can't quite believe. And and I just um, I kind of. I, I, I love the feel of it. Um, by the end, I was going quite quickly, um, but on a very, very gentle nursery slope. Uh, at the end, we used ski poles um, as slalom so that we had to practice going round corners. It was really, really good, and um, and I can't wait for tomorrow. We're back from our second day of skiing and oh my goodness, the snow today, it was just magical. There was so much snow and it was falling all day long. So it was phenomenal. I've, I've never seen snow like that before. It got a little bit challenging when, um, when you know, you couldn't, the visibility wasn't that great, but when you're only on nursery slopes, that doesn't seem to matter. We made really good progress today. I uh, got to go on a on a slightly um, better incline or a, a more of an incline, so I was practicing my skills more, and and I got up some speed, and I, I learned that my um, my left leg seems to lead, so I was having to practice quite a lot on my right leg, dropping my right shoulder to make sure that I handled the turns properly, but it was incredible. So we're back at the chalet now. Um, we're going to have a, a bath, a rest our feet, um, and uh, well, maybe a cheeky beer. So um, we've just finished day three on the slopes and I'm really starting to feel it now. We had the most amazing weather today. It was crystal blue skies, beautiful sunshine, and it was incredible. It's some of the most beautiful views I think I've ever seen in my whole life. I felt that um, I really kind of started to master some of the balance in the morning ski lessons with Zoe. Um, but right now, all I want to do is run the hot bath, go and pick up my cup of tea, and have whatever cake that they've baked today. So. I will see you on the slopes tomorrow. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> so 
So we're just back from our final ski lessons um, and although I'm completely and utterly exhausted, I am just exhilarated. We started off the morning by um, going up one of the new uh, lifts that we hadn't been on before and um, when we got to the top <laughs> and I saw the run we were going to have to go down, I have to say I had a, a small crisis of, of confidence. But um, Zoe was so good, we took it really slow and as soon as I got into the rhythm of it, I was absolutely loving it. So at the beginning of this adventure just a week ago, I really thought that I wasn't going to be able to learn to ski, that I was going to be too sore, that I was going to be too old, that it was all just going to be a bit frightening. And, and now I feel like at certain points of the day, I was properly skiing. We absolutely loved Zoe. She was so patient with Tom and I. One of the great things about doing the ski lessons was that Zoe was able to teach us how to get on and off lifts, which can be quite scary. She was able to tell us the etiquette of the slopes and what to do when you know people come fast. She told us how to get out of tricky situations, like if you end up facing the wrong way down the slope. So it, was, it wasn't just about, about skiing and about our technique. It was also about how to be on the slopes, how to navigate your way around. There's no question, it's such a fun family holiday. And for us to all have learnt together and gone through the skills and, and started to build up our experience, it's really been such a magical, magical experience. And um, now we're all set to go back home tomorrow, which makes me really sad, but we've got one more meal in the chalet, another, another extravagant meal, I'm sure, um, but hopefully today we've earned it.